spendthrift. Megan was thrown off the mask of bogus simplicity, burns money like a giant furnace. Spending money like water is an usual lifestyle of Megan. In the part, Megan is keen on luxury brand clothing. It has been reported by the media that she spends more than 1 million British luxury clothes every year, and because she dresses appropriately and leads the fashion trend, she is regarded as a benchmark figure in the European and American fashion circles. Meghan once drew criticism from people from all walks of life for hosting a luxurious baby welcome party in a luxury hotel in New York. Although there are reports that Meghan's friends paid for the luxurious party, Many British people still believe that as a member of the royal family, she enjoys public support but is not grateful. She is high profile and extravagant, which is really detrimental to the image of the royal family. Now, there are reports about Meghan spending money. According to the British media Daily Express, Meghan is now in a lawsuit with the British media. According to the latest information, Meghan will spend £1.8 million in the lawsuit which is equivalent to about 18 million. Yuan Renminbi. Yi Jun felt that Megan was really cruel and unrelenting in burning money. Think about it, she would spend 18 million yuan in a lawsuit. For ordinary people, such a huge litigation fee. The price is simply sky high. Maybe it's because the rich people think differently from our ordinary people. Anyway, I think it is very difficult to understand. How many houses and luxury cars can be bought for this 18 million yuan? Use such a huge amount of money what's wrong, it's just used to litigate and burnt for nothing, this is simply incomprehensible. Can you understand? Yesterday on her YouTube channel, Megan dresses up her denim with $444,900 worth of jewelry. Duchess Don's Princess Diana's Cartier tank watch, tennis bracelet and custom pinky ring made from Middle Eastern gift for appearance on YouTube. Meghan Markle looked effortlessly chic during her latest appearance online today, donning one of her favored looks of a shirt and jeans combo, as well as jewelry worth over $400,000. The Duchess of Sussex, 40, who gave birth to her daughter Lilibet Diana Mountbatten Windsor on June 4 this year appeared on the YouTube account Brightly Storytime to read her children's book The Bench. Dressed in a casual blue shirt, with her long sleeves rolled up, Megan opted to add some glitz to her ensemble with a $23,000 gold Cartier tank watch that once belonged to Princess Diana and was gifted to her by her husband in the early years of their relationship, which she paired with a $6,900 Cartier love bangle. She is also thought to have sported a $3,000 mini gold tennis bracelet designed by Jennifer Meyer and a pinky ring designed by celebrity jeweler Lorraine Schwartz and worth an estimated $62,000. Page 6 previously claimed the mysterious piece was made with gifted diamonds from the Middle East. Sitting on a comfy looking chair in her garden at her $14.65 million Montecito mansion, she shares with Prince Harry and their two children, Archie, two, and Lilibet, the Duchess completed her look with a smattering of glamorous makeup. Wanting to stick to her low key vibe, the mother of two kept her locks tied back away from her face when reading from her £12.99 book which is inspired by Prince Harry and her son Archie. Meghan Markle, pictured, looked effortlessly chic during her latest appearance online today, donning one of her favored looks of a shirt and jeans combo, as well as jewelry worth over $400,000. On the other hand, the Duchess of Cambridge, Catherine Elizabeth Middleton, Kate Middleton is renowned popularly as the queen of wearing highly affordable fashion. Even though having a huge collection of designer brands, she still loves adorning herself in inexpensive and yet fashionable outfits which then become a raging trend globally. Kate Middleton is often spotted wearing her ever-growing list of favorite designer brands on rotation, despite living in the royal family for over a decade. With eyes turning everywhere as to what the pretty royal is wearing, she stuns us every single time with the gorgeous yet so humble way in which she carries herself everywhere. Owning a grand collection of best and high brands like Herdem and Amila Wickstead, Alexander McQueen, Chanel, Mulberry and many more, 
she still shops happily from the most affordable, inexpensive and yet so grateful outfits from those brands regularly. Grateful outfits from